Hi everybody, I am Brentman19 and welcome to episode 40 of our British World Domination Campaign in Empire Total War. So, I am building a fourth army here in between Vienna, Venice, and Zagreb. They're going to all meet at Zagreb, then they're going to march for Istanbul. Russia declared war. So, I'm hoping that I can get my troops that were taking Zagreb all the way over here to Lwów, finish off Poland, and then start my war against Molda, uh, against, uh, Russia here as well. Hopefully they've got their troops so far apart, even though I do see guys here and I do see some here. Hopefully uh, that's not too indicative of where they all are. And I've got troops. i got more than enough troops to handle that. Also over here in India, I've got my third army going for Katak, which they'll do for one more turn because I like lost all my money. And, uh, They'll take that, then we'll move on east to uh, Bengal. I think that's probably the better moves to do here. Yeah, take Calcutta, and then they can come around. Uh, well, hopefully by then we'll take this. That's going to be a problem. What's the... Uh, they're having war weariness. Religious unrest is a problem. Tax burden, yeah, government, the clamor for reforms. They're having a lot of issues here. Uh, hopefully, war weariness continues. They go they start looking like going there bankrupt or something. That'll all help as I'm pushing through India from the east. And I'll be coming west, from the west across as well. Russia and Marath are the two largest powers in front of me. Austria is all clustered together. They're a really easy to take out. Uh, Sweden's really clustered and close. Uh, I'll probably continue with an army just going one, 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 one across, and then uh, they'll, the last thing that th that army will do is take Denmark. Maybe I'll have my men able to come back. We can look at the United Provinces, but it is 1767, so I need to really start finishing things. I need to have a focus on not blockading, you know, not sieging, but actually taking. Could even be a good idea to use this army here, you know, to come on over here and knock out Malta as well. You know, maybe that's on our way back, I don't know. Maybe after I take out this stuff. Okay, um, I don't have much money, we're gonna have to end the, end the turn there. This Austria don't declare war on me. I really can't I can't stand going to war with somebody else right now with such a large front. Oh, come on, I could have really used that Prussia. It's all right, right there. I have a feeling the Marathans have a lot of armies, but they're so spread out and they're real small. Rioting has broken out in this region as the lower orders have become too unhappy. You must either appease the rioters by lowering taxes, or send in the troops to put them down. Whatever you do, it's all fine. Act quickly before the riot becomes a rebellion. Fix that. Lord? Roughly one turn away from heading there. And that army is all fixed up anyway. Um, Goa and Hyderabad I need to pay attention to. the nature of this being a capital I will siege it settlement besieged I 
until we take it and go after Ottman. Yeah, I'll need to wait on that one. Um, we'll go here. 1980 versus 779. They're so sure we'll win. I'm just going to do this. I really don't want shipyards here. Get rid of the great ashrams. This one is a... Okay, so whatever can be underneath that turn I will do. Ready and waiting for all. and country! Your humble servant. Okay. So India is done. One more turn and these guys will pump out the necessary troops. Four, five, yeah. Zadar is four away. Really doesn't seem to matter on that front so much. Um, Make ready. How long do they think it's going to take? Maybe ten turns to get that? Oh my gosh. Alright, well, we'll have to just deal with it. There's nothing we can really do but deal with that. I could use this army to come down and take Kiev, but I'd be leaving my north so open. Just trying to think. This army comes through, takes this. We'll go here, take Moldavia. Then from there, this guy could hit Ukraine. This guy hits Courland eventually. At least moving him out. I mean, one of the two is fine. Um... That's still going. Going to do the Army Staff College. I mean, they're getting a lot of, like, changes here, but once I knock him out, he's done. They're doing 2% per turn here to Lowell. See if I can hit these guys real fast. Triumphant. At the ready. Make ready. But. There you go. I mean, it could it could have been much worse. I mean, I'm not ready to move on to Kiev yet, but it's I mean it's a good you know a good spot to be in. They seem to be having a hard time up here though. 
Maybe the Russians are wearing down the Swedes. Maybe the Swedes are using the wars that Russia's currently in now to uh, you know, do whatever they can to stop them. Gotta wait it out. I could use this guy to come knock these ones around and then maybe do a little bit of damage here. I don't know. That's gonna take a long time to get down there. I think that's all I can do. Yep, that's it. I don't think I have anything else I can do out there, so let's go ahead and end the turn. Austrians just kind of centralizing in the east of my current territories along the Adriatic. As long as they let me through, this isn't all for nothing. Even if they don't, don't let me through, I'll have a fourth army to go north and just wreck. Going northeast is wonderful. Ooh, they're going to try to break out here. 1895 versus however many of that is. Roughly 1777? Roughly? <laughs> I mean, it's a nice little battle for us. It's defensive. Which is really nice. It's early on during the uh, siege, so we can recoup our troops in time to fight them again later. Okay. John Adams, the second U.S. president. We're in a war, damn it. We're going to have to offend somebody sometime. Gosh, I feel like that nowadays. You know, here we are, and the, you know, here we are, and we're so afraid of offending people. Like, you're going to have to offend somebody here. You know, we have a lot of threats to the U.S. Not any, like, super legitimate ones, I'll give you that. Those of, those of you who do not think that the U.S. has real threats, we don't have too many legitimate ones. Not sitting here saying that a, another country is going to pop up and say it's, you know, try to invade us or anything. But we do have threats. All right, uh, uh, there we go. Um, these guys. I'm trying to just get some troops in a position first before I start trying to do anything wild. They're trying to move war element elephants forward. we go. I think they're going to try to come forward now. We did good in the first round on that side. Yeah, this is a good time to get a lot of experience. On the cannons at least.
Yeah, we're shattering guys left and right here. Keep hitting. Keep shooting, keep depleting them of all that they got. pretty well so far. Anything that we don't shatter now, we can shatter later. A ton of damage right there. Oh, ain't that some crap right there? Getting attacked from the rear. We're doing okay, and now we're wavering. Maybe they might go first. Nope, we're shattered. They shattered. In the battle, heroic victory, though. I mean, maybe we didn't lose too many men in that. 210 will kill 1277. Strength and honor. There you go. That's one little stat gone. Peace treaty for asked for the knights. Nope. Now, knights, I'm getting. The, I'm about there to have the weapons to kill you. That has not yet been developed. Select the type of port to construct here. A fishing port will help your population grow. A trade port will provide an income from overseas trade. A naval port allows the construction of warships. New town in Tunis. I guess I'll give you a craft workshop. That seems to be the only extra thing that would be really nice there. Government chambers in Cairo. So that place is fully... Confirmed to be handing down to us. Okay. Let's go here. None shall defeat us. Maybe I'll go on and take that there. These guys. There's all 20. Let's start marching down to there. Much longer on this. Three more turns, I can start building the navy I want to really take out, you know, any of the other threats I have in the region. Siege. Fix up troops. I really just wanted to stop them there. Um, Forward, up. Sir. 
to go on here. Um, Siege them. Wow, they accepted that. You gotta be kidding. That's awesome. Guess they're scared, man. Coward's gonna coward, man. It's fun here. So with that taken, I mean, we're looking really good. We'll take this, move on, you know, once we can, we'll move on after that. I mean, I own the entire east coast of India now. If I could push on and take ne uh, Barar, take Atmad Atmad Nagar, there you go. And Bijapur, I could take those two and just move on, I mean... Here and there, with him taking up to here. Boom, boom, boom. That holding those three, move up. Those three. There, there, there. Those three. These guys will be coming along too. Yes. Lord. Almost there. He's down to eight. He will slowly get there, I'm sure. I'll go ahead and do these great estates here. Because if I can get them to the... Uh, what are those really, really nice things? The palatial estates? If I can get those things up... Things should uh, improve greatly. Gives me a little bit more to my nobility, I believe, right? Let's look at this one just to make sure. Nobility gets a little bit, reduces food shortages. I mean, just makes things easier. Not really worried about my nobility so much as I am about the lower classes. We take, we get rid of that, we come up here. This guy goes down and east. This guy comes down here, takes that. Boom, and just keep, you know, pushes up through here. Pushes over here. Guess I could wait till I got this guy here. This guy and this guy. Take here. You might be able to do some stuff here, or I could take this guy to go through here, another one through there while holding on to Moscow. It's another idea. So many ideas, but no time to execute them in this execute them. In this turn, we're just gonna have to keep on keeping on. So alright guys, appreciate y'all so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Check the link for Discord in the description below, and I'll see you all next time.